Among the things that the Prophet hated, sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, is argument. And it was reported in a number of hadiths. When people talked back to him in an argumentative way, he would be upset and that would be seen on his face, as in the case when he visited his daughter and his son-in-law and recommended them to pray night prayer instead of sleeping. And Ali, may Allah be pleased with him, the cousin of the Prophet said, well, our souls are in the hands of Allah. Whenever Allah Azza wa Jal sets us to wake up, we will pray. And this is not an appropriate answer. One should have said, inshallah, we will do that. And the Prophet left and said that man was mostly argumentative. That's amazing. Instead of being cooperative and saying, Jazakallah khair, we will do that. Likewise, the Prophet's face would change when he sees sinful things. When a sin is committed, as in the case when he saw one of his friends wearing a ring made of gold, you can see that he hated this on his face. He went there and took it off and said, why would anyone put a stone of fire in his hand and tossed it away? This is something that we also have to have in us. Nowadays, we see vice and evil things happening all around us, in our own homes, in the streets, in the malls. We see haram being committed, the mixing of men and women, the music, the entertainment. All of this is something that Allah Azza wa Jal hates. And the Prophet وسلم, hates. And it's a sign of hypocrisy not to hate it. When you feel that, whoa, this is cool, this is fun, I am, I'm enjoying myself, and you don't see any signs of hatred on your face to such sinful acts, in this case, this is a huge sign of hypocrisy. May Allah Azza wa Jal make us among those who enforce and enjoin virtue and righteousness among the Muslims.